Hey, this is Robert at Guzzi Fabrication. Hey, I've got a really cool video for you today. Now, a buddy stopped by the shop, and he brought his 1918 paddy wagon. Now, about eight years ago, I hand-fabricated this body and then modified some fenders for this build. And we're going to just do a quick walk around. And I also dug up some build pictures that I'll show you later of the whole process. And the inspiration for this build came from a model that this guy had when he was younger. And I believe the uh, model was from Ravel. And it's an exact copy of that model. Same color, same pretty much everything. He was really exact to the detail. And it looks like he's driven this thing about a million miles. He said he's had quite a bit of fun in it. And it looks like he's running a uh, small block Ford with a standard transmission. That's got to be crazy. There, here's a quick shot of the interior he did. I think he uh, installed all this himself. Put in a wood gra uh, dash. And you'll notice the uh, moto meter there on top of the radiator. That's functional. That's his temperature gauge. And that exhaust just dumps into a box pretty much. Yeah, it's uh, a, little, a little loud. There you can see the uh, wood dash that he built for that thing all right let's get into the build pictures hey here's uh, what I started with 1918 Cal then I fabricated a smooth insert and installed it into the cowl and then did some lead work and for the gentleman's last name I bead rolled a B and here it is framed out. Now I used one by one square tubing to fabricate the framework. And then I finished all of that out with 18 gauge sheet metal. And here's a shot of the uh, fender. Now these came from like Northern Tool. Then I stretched it and then reshaped it and curved it uh, to match the shape of the model. Shot of the front fenders. That have been modified. And here they are installed. Yeah, this was a really, really fun project. And that's it as the last time that I pretty much had seen it. Hey, I really hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.